Mobility Tuesday, here we are. I'm gonna show you some great mobility moves to help your triceps, and we'll go into some forearm, okay? So sometimes when you're lifting really heavy weights and you're having an arms day or whatever, your triceps are gonna get really sore. If you mobilize those babies and you mash them out, guess what? Recovery time's like half the time, okay? Then you're back in the gym and you're lifting weights again, no problem but you might be sore for a few days if you don't mobilize. And so to get into that tricep area, I like to use a foam roller. And the best way to do this is you can be on your knees here if you want to, um, or you can sprawl one leg out and kind of come just like this. Bring this arm up and just start to rock over that foam roller while lifting your arm up like this. We can hit that tricep. If you want to go deeper, you can, of course, drop both legs right here and get your whole entire body weight over that tricep, but you're only able to move it like an inch or two, okay? It's going to go deep here. But that's how I get into that tricep. If I put my left hand here for support, I can just really push up into this and then put, bring it down, okay? This is a great tricep mobilization, so I would try that. And then I would also hit that forearm because, you know, we don't massage this area of our body hardly at all. So what I would do is I would grab myself a yoga block, I would prop it up this nice lengthwise here, and then I would get, I would get a peanut. This is two tennis balls and a sock, and I'd put that peanut here, and I'd bring my wrist up just like this, bring my other hand on top, and then I would start to roll and mash up to my elbow and right down to my wrist, really getting in there deep. You'll feel this right away, okay? And it feels really good, but it's also one of those painful good feelings. But again, you'll, you'll, you might feel some ropey bits in there. You'll feel like you're going over some bumps. It's because we get knotted up in that area too. We've got a lot going on in those forearms. We need to start to mash it out. And especially if you have a job where you're using your hands a lot, maybe you're typing a lot, or you're a chiropractor and you're adjusting people, maybe you're a chef and you cook or you're cutting people's hair, we all use our hands a lot, but some of us use our hands more than others. Then you especially should be coming here and rolling out that forearm, getting into that wrist. And then you can turn it sideways and go up the side of your arm here, okay? Go up the side of your arm. Can you do this without a block? Yeah, you can. You'll just have to come down a little bit deeper here and move your body a little bit more in that position, okay? It's just a little more comfortable for some of you guys to have it propped up here. So that's why I say get a block, get a block. You can also go wrist down and we can get this whole inside area of that arm, okay? So just pressing down, going deep here that's going to help to relieve any kind of strain. And especially you people also who play tennis or golf and you're using your arm a lot, you might get tennis elbow. In the which case, I would purchase some, something called Voodoo Floss. Uh, maybe I ought to show that to you. Hang on. Okay, so this is Voodoo Floss right here. And this is stretchy. And for my people who have like um, problems with their elbow, their tennis elbow right here, or they get, you know, s stiff in their arms. This is when you, it, it's, it's a stretchy rubber band here, and you might need some help with it, but you're going to be wrapping this about 70% tight, so it's cutting off circulation. You'll go around the bottom of your arm and then up the top right here, but you don't have to go right over your elbow, and then you can just start to move that arm. This is going to help to cut out inflammation in the arm. So I recommend to my clients, to my students, to my customers, that they do this, if they buy one of these, you go to roguefitness.com, R-O-G-U-E, and you'll type in Voodoo Floss, V-O-O-D-O-O, -O -O. that's Voodoo Floss. This is great for your knees, it's great for your elbow, it's great for your hamstring, you can get into your ankles and your feet with this. I use it all the time with my people. Okay, and so three times a day, one minute to two minutes, it's cutting off the circulation, but you're moving it. It's gonna help take inflammation out so that you're able to move better.
okay? So if you have any questions, reach out to me. I don't want you to be in pain in those arms and in those wrists and in that tricep. Let's make sure that our arms feel really, really good so we can continue to lift weights at the gym and continue to do all those activities we love to do like tennis, um, maybe you're a pickleball player, maybe you're playing some golf, all of that stuff. So maybe next week I'll hit the rotator cuff area, show you how to get into that area too as well. But for today, for today, this is Mobility Tuesday. We worked triceps, forearms, arms, elbow, that kind of stuff. So have a great rest of your day, and I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.